Hello friends, this is Sasha with Harmony Air. Uh, today I would like to sh uh, show you our um, latest ins installation of the Solark system with battery backup. This is a grid tight system, but it's fully capable of um, being off grid. We have two Solark 12Ks, um, so we can have a combined output um, on a, during the off grid of about 100, um, about 80, uh, 80 amps, um, and on grid um, pass through is uh, 60 amps per inverter. So we we have a critical load panel that's uh, supplied by roughly 120 amps um, while on grid. Um, the reason I would like to share this installation with you is because we used uh, FNS batteries with this system um, and we also had a backup generator. Um, as usual using um, raceways I find it, uh, it kind of really the easiest and the neatest way to to do the job um, and um, because the inverters, um, the Solarks, they kind of um, wider than the raceway, the easiest thing is to use a flexible, um, flexible uh, um, thin wall conduits for um, wire wires. But uh, we we usually use a six by six raceways. If we use the eight by eight. Um, they stick far enough from the wall where we could use uh, rigid uh, lines as well. Um, but um, here are the two Solarks. Uh, as usual, we're using Taigo optimizers, um, uh, very rel reliable and giving us uh, full control over the and monitoring over the solar panels. Um, now I'll show you the FNS batteries. Um, so the FNS units, they um, come with those um, cabinets and each battery module within the cabinet, those specifically have four modules. Each has a its own little switch uh, to turn off individual battery modules um, and then on the inside there's an actual uh, 200 amp main breaker that um, turns off the entire battery output of, of uh, each cabinet and we have two, two cabinets on this project um, uh, the modules are light enough where one one person could lift it up. Of course, if you want to save your back, two people are easier. Um, as far as uh, all the communication wiring and everything, and um, um, it it wasn't too difficult. It's really a daisy chain, um, and you do need to uh, um, with the deep switches over here. Each, each battery needs to um, get addressed and um, yeah gro just ground your system um, there is a positive bar and a negative bar pre-installed inside each cabinet relatively speaking um, very doable um, uh, on this project the fire department requ required us to put the batteries 18 inches off the ground. Um, it is uh, so we had to construct this stand out of unistruts. It's absolutely unnecessary, but nevertheless we had to do that. Um, yeah, so each one of those cabinets is 19.4. 
kilowatts. So uh, uh, this is almost a 40 kilowatt backup uh, system. Um, hope you find this interesting and if you have any questions, uh, you're welcome to get in touch with me. Thank you. Bye-bye.